How's it going, fellas and ladies? Smoking my Tim Tom Carell Cherrywood Poker. Second smoke. And it's also my second smoke of Penzance, Esoterica Penzance. And I've had this tobacco for a while. And believe it or not, I only tried it once. And that one time I tried it, the first time, so good. It was so good that I didn't want to try it again. Strangely. Because I didn't think I could reproduce that first smoke. That first perfect smoke I had. And I told my wife. And she said, just smoke it. So that's what I'm doing. I'm smoking it. Second time. Now this is a different pipe. And uh, some tobaccos, uh, the experience of smoking them is a little bit different, or a lot different, with a different kind uh, of pipe. So I thought I would try it with this one this time and see if it's if I liked it as much and I'm about a fifth of a bowl down and yes definitely this is still my number one tobacco um, too bad too I really did not want to like it as much as I do so and this was uh, given to me this tobacco was given to me by uh, stay-at-home piper Alec thank you so much Alec I'm I'm really enjoying this this tobacco I know it sounds odd it was so good that I didn't want to smoke it that'll make sense to some of you I'm sure So a while back, a couple months ago, I was told there was tins of Penzance at a certain place, and I bought two tins, and I'm not going to crack those open for, I'm going to say, at least a year. So that's why I'm milking, milking this Penzance I have jarred up, maybe three quarters of an ounce or so. It's strange how a flavor, a taste or smell can just bring you right back to a place you've been or an experience you've had. When I smoke this Penzance, it brings me to the, uh, the coast of England, the salty air, the rolling green fields, uh, Maybe the White Cliffs. White Cliffs of Dover was really nice. So that's where, that's where I go back to as I'm tasting this tobacco. You guys have a great weekend.